Hello. You're watching Mixy TV. There's a thing I found today. It's called On Live, and it's pretty cool. It streams games to your computer, so like you can play the latest games regardless of your PC specs. Um, let's have a quick look. There's this thing called the arena where you can sort of look around what people, other people on the network are playing at the same time. This, you can sign up for free and you can rent for three or five days games or you can just buy them outright so you can just play them whenever you want. Um, let's have a look at some of these. So this is live, someone in somewhere is playing this right now and we're watching them. You can see here, you see spectators, one, that's me. Cheers, no one likes this. And jeers, no one dislikes this. Um, this is pure, the game pure. Um, let's have a look at something else. What's this? This is Batman Arkham Asylum. And he just failed that mission. Um, let's have a look at something else. A lot of people are playing Assassin's Creed right now. I've seen this game before. What's that called? World of Goo. What an awesome game. There's voice chat. There's voice chat in this um, system. So you can talk to the people who are playing the games and they can talk to you. Just have a good old chat. It's like a fun game. Look at these guys out here, over here. Um, you can see it's designed for console because um, you can actually order the lights like, pack. It comes in a box and you hook it up to your TV so you can play it through TV. It's a bit like a console. And then you get a uh, game controller. There's Assassin's Creed. So it's ideally controlled via the uh, cursor keys. Anyway, here's the profile, your profile, your games, friends, brag clips. Brag clips are these things here, they're like really short 30 second or 15 second clips of your best moments or your worst fails that you can upload, so like this guy. jumps on a bike. Oh, he jumps through the, route, the road. Okay, that's quite funny. Let's have a look at this in Red Faction Gorilla. Uh, he knocked over a bridge and got caught in the supports. Right. What about what about this one in Just Cause? This is pretty cool. Oh, double flip. He's gonna land on his wheels, isn't he? <laughs> That's pretty cool. So yeah, it's like a mini YouTube, I guess. We've got a showcase here, showcasing the latest deals. We've got the ball, Fear Three, Pure. Space Marine. You can check out my games. I haven't got any games at the moment, obviously. Just checking this out at the moment. Here's the marketplace. It's a bit like Steam in some ways. You can see here, like a lot of them are on sale. You can pre-order games that haven't been released yet. And if we go down here, see this game called Ah 
it has a free trial available. You can actually like play the game for free. Um, I already tried that, but we won't try that. Let's try something decent to show you. Let's try Alien vs Predator. You see? So you can rent it for three days, five days, or you can just buy it for nineteen ninety nine dollars. Let's check out the free trial. So this is just on a um, simple Wi-Fi connection. Um, I get about one meg download per second speed, just so you can compare it to your internet. And this isn't installed on my computer or anything. This is just like literally real time. I just click it and it loads up. Now that is pretty good graphics. This is recorded on about 720p and you can press Alt Enter which makes it full screen. The resolution doesn't increase when you put it on full screen but overall it's moderately good quality picture. So there we go, I'll just skip that and get into the game. So this is streaming the picture from a uh, server somewhere in America or something. So it's just installed on their games, on their uh, computers. Here we go, I'm just going to test out the. Uh... Come on. Yeah, so I'm looking around. It's um, compared. It... I'd say there's about. I don't know. A small millisecond delay. There you go, I'm just going to inject myself. And I can't actually move. Oh, here we go. Okay, so it's moderately good for just like streaming for what it is. Maybe toss a flare down. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if you didn't have a gaming PC and you're just playing on a laptop, if you really love gaming and there's no way you can get a gaming PC, you will love this. It is a really good quality for the price and the amount of games in the selection, the variety that you get is just, it is pretty insane. So, so there we go, that's a quick look at the games. Just uh, quit this. All progress is saved on your on live account, by the way. There we go, so we just exit out of this.
and then we got your friends list, just like Steam. So overall, I'd say this is a revolutionary system that they've got in place. Um, I heard about it being developed a few years ago, and I've only just really noticed it um, being used this much recently. Um, a lot of reviews coming out about it. Um, it has huge potential. The only disadvantages of it are, of course, the game quality. The picture quality is um, a relatively low resolution compared to, um, I don't know, 1080p monitors, which most gamers play on these days sort of uh, 21 inch screens, you'll definitely notice a, um, a great decrease in resolution pitch quality. Um, the lag between your movements and response in game is minimal, it's noticeable for gamers, for hardcore gamers, um, I don't think you'll be able to um, choose this over installing the game on your PC yourself, but perhaps you may be at a LAN or a friend's house or even on holiday and you've got a decent internet connection over there, you can play your games. I mean, just the um, arena on its own, just watching this, this is completely free. And I mean, like you could just go into someone's game watch it, it's kind of like a movie. It's also got potential for reviewing games. You just use a 30 minute trial to do the intro of the game and um, yeah you can see what it's like. Oh I love Lego games. Lego Star Wars, one of the best games ever on the PS2. I think this is Lego Batman. Yeah. Unreal Tournament. So there we go. Check it out yourself. It's uh, free to register and sign up. And tiny, absolutely tiny to, to, to download. It's about a meg in size, the installer. And once it's installed, it's like, I don't know, 7 meg. It's ridiculous. So there we go. And I'll see you soon. Goodbye.